Hey everyone, welcome to the moving vlogs, the artsy moving vlogs. It has, well, I mean, you guys already know, you guys were there for the very first box in the apartment, but I am going to start oh, packing all of this. I feel like I came into this space with a lot of materials already and then um, it just, you know, it exploded even further. Uh, you know, and we've got another shelf on the bottom. That mirror is still blue. Is she ever going to do anything with it? Who knows? Maybe. But I'm going to start packing up. Probably going to start with this top shelf because it's all like art like past videos that we've done so I thought it would be fun to do it with you guys. So yeah, the move is next weekend. I don't know when you're watching this. I'm I'm assuming that throughout the week there's probably going to be multiple vlogs this week. I think I'm going to light up the vlog channel <laughs> with all of this moving content because one I'm excited about it. <laughs> um two, I have taken a break from I'm calling it a break. Uh, but I've taken a break from um, uploading like art videos on my main channel because obviously I would need to work in this space to continue uploading those videos. Plus, I realized that besides camping once last week, last weekend, I wish, um, actually no I don't wish because it's probably freezing, um, besides camping once last summer, <laughs> I haven't taken a break since I started my YouTube channel, which I think has been two years, maybe, almost, maybe three, I'm not sure. So yeah, I'm calling it a break, but it's because we're moving. So I am going to begin packing at least this top shelf that has a bunch of videos that we've done. And oh my God, look at this. It's the, uh, little peeps that we did actually this time last year right because Easter is literally this weekend uh, we're not moving this weekend we're moving next weekend today is Friday probably should have told you that so that you understand <laughs> where we are uh, but yeah look at this <laughs> it still looks pretty good I feel like in the viewfinder it's looking a, a lot clearer I guess it is very clear the glitter in it is kind of throwing me off a little bit but Peeps still look all right. Yeah, that's this, and it's gonna go in the box. Some I need to get the paper out, actually. You guys, did you see the mirror? <laughs> While we're talking about uh, videos and stuff, did you see this video yet? I uploaded it last week. I made a full-length mirror, uh, tufted floral. See, I still don't even know what to call it. I tufted this frame. This like floral frame, tufted it myself. Uh, you can see me show you how to do it in last week's video. I'll try to link it down in the description. There's actually like a lot in here. There's definitely like so much more than I started with. All right, so I wanna start with the big stuff, like these big wooden paintings up here. Oh, this is, we're just gonna go down memory lane in this video. You guys remember this? Have you been? on the Artsy Mad Woman <laughs> channel for long enough to remember the purple boob. <laughs> There's a comment on this, I can't remember why I was talking about this, because I don't think I ever turned it into a video. This was like a test thing to, to see if this could work. And I remember in some video where I showed this, somebody commented, <laughs> they like time stamped when I showed this, and then they were like, there's a scary face in the boob. <laughs> <laughs> that I that comment I think about it like every single time I look at this and you can see that's my face the scary face <laughs> that's my face um yeah there's a picture of me and one of my oldest friends inside this and obviously the experiment failed but did it fail in creating something hilarious and like a complete memory for me no it absolutely succeeded still got it look at that uh, don't look at it. I'm sorry if you have like trip tripophobia, tryptophobia. I always say it wrong, but sorry, sorry. <laughs> there, I uh, I put it away for you. Sorry. <laughs> Dirty as freaking heckin' darn. So we've got this. This was when we did fluid. F f what do you call this? Fluid art. Hmm. It's like alcohol inks and then fluid. Uh, why can't I think of this? This reminds me of like a galaxy or something. It's so pretty. 
Anyway, I'm gonna fold this up and some paper. This is my, what do you call this? It's like the, it's the YouTube plaque for getting to 100,000 subscribers. And um, I put, I feel like you can't see it that well here, but I usually this part is like empty um, and it's just like that mirrored effect on the back, but I filled it with resin and also holographic glitter and like holographic stars. But yeah, I don't know why you can't see it that well. Anyway, you get it. I, I did that and uh, I think I actually turned that into a video. So, and then this is like the the letter that goes with it being like, wow, you're awesome. So yeah, this is obviously um, a complete memory for me and I kind of cry looking at it. So I'm, so I'm still so like proud of this. You know what? We're almost at 200,000 subscribers on the main channel. I think we're at um, 197 right now, I think. And so yeah, this is just crazy. Anyway, I can actually like hang it because we're gonna be in our own space once we move. So I'm gonna hang this on the wall for the first time ever. Ta-da! My beautiful wrapping skills. Next up is, oh my God. What, like we're not working with resin anymore on the main channel, but this is already made. I still need to turn this into a Lazy Susan or something. That, when I made this video, by the way, if you don't know, I think this is like one of my biggest resin fails or something. I tried to do like a 3D, and it is sort of 3D when you look at it. But um, I tried to do like a 3D painting, like rainbow swirl. <laughs> I wanted it to definitely be more of a 3D effect, but uh, to do that, I would have had to make it really, I think I was trying to turn this into a clock, right? And then the clock parts were too small. Anyway, so in that video I asked, uh, what do you think I should do with this? And one of my favorite suggestions was to turn it into a Lazy Susan because it's a spiral, you know? So, wait, Lazy Susan? No, not a Lazy S Wait, hold on, what's a Lazy Susan? <laughs> Is a Lazy Susan the, like, cabinet thing that spins? Because if it's that, then no. What's the thing that... Like you, you put it on the table and it, it spins. Do you know what I'm saying? Like you can put, um, like salsa or something, different things on it and you put it on the table and you can like spin it around. What's that called? Because that's what I was thinking of and I feel like that would be really cool because it's a spiral. So I still need to do that and I could do it, uh, because we're, it's already made, you know what I'm saying? Okay, next is I should, something I should have shown in the resin pieces like year later, resin art years later video because this is a piece, obviously it's got like real flowers in it and it's kind of a chunky piece. Uh, this looks real good. It still looks really beautiful. Oh. <laughs> it doesn't even look like it's in resin. It just looks like flowers are just like popping out at you. It's so beautiful. Wow. Like, once again, forgot to show this, so the vlog gets to see it. It still looks beautiful. I think, I can't remember, but I think this is like a year old. I don't know, I should actually look it up because I, I don't remember, but it could be a little less than a year. But, you know, still, still looking beautiful. I do feel like I have a snot in my nose, so if you see it, let me know. <laughs> I don't see anything from here. Cool. Just blow it out. Ew! <laughs> All right, Miranda's here now, and Hi. we really only have a couple of things left. We made this uh, last Halloween. <laughs> That's cool. Noise. I think it's better than the original, but only because of the. Letters. Well, I like the original because you did a capital T. I like lowercase letters more than uppercase. Well, no, but starting off the whole thing, uh -huh. I feel like it should be capitalized. But capital T's are like really ugly. Look at this. Well, I don't know what Look. actual couple. Cool. Oh wow. <laughs> Look at this T. Lowercase T's better than capital T's and I will hear nothing else about it. Don't the even try to change my mind. T, I don't know what it looks like. Alright, we're back. It's the next day and we're gonna continue. We're gonna continue.
Yeah, so? She's making fun of my molds. Do you have more of this stuff somewhere? At home, I have more of this. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Your molds are gonna be everywhere. Dude. Actually, they already can are. I see everywhere. that long one? Oh yeah. Dude, help! Help me! <laughs> How does this go in? Or is it this side? Reroll it. Oh my god, it started at the bottom. Never. <laughs> Whatever. Whatever. <laughs> Good job. Get in there. Oh. Yeah. Oh! Look, you did it! Wow. Okay, wow. lift up the box. Beautiful! Oh, hell yeah. Hell yeah. All right, day three of clearing out or trying to pack up my art space and this is kind of where we're at you know in a second i'm going to show you box number one of yarn sean tried to fit as much as he could into a new box because the original box um is ripping because there's so much yarn and i can't remember if i showed you guys yesterday but here is what the shelves are looking like now pretty good i just have to get this stuff and some things behind here into a bigger box we've also got everything on this thing that we have to do we have all of this stuff which is all like the electroforming stuff but i don't it looks insane and it kind of is but also it looks this insane because there are like there are boxes everywhere so it's hard to like put stuff and make it look neat and tidy <laughs> Anyway, so I'm going to get started on boxing up the rest of the stuff that is on these shelves. I am going to use this thing again. We used it once forever ago. This is the, what do they call it? Something, mold press, right? Yeah, mold press. It's like making hard plastic molds. I think it's mostly for candy. Um, it didn't work super well with resin, but since we're not doing resin anymore, we can test this out again oh, yeah. and maybe actually make little chocolates. That would be amazing. You can make weird shaped chocolates. So, we have box number one of all tufting stuff. Tufting fabric, the tufting gun, projector, there's yarn underneath. And then, box number two is all yarn for tufting. So, two whole boxes for tufting. And then, we've made some progress. And the shelves are basically done. Yeah. The rest is just, like, getting thrown out. These are so heavy that, like, why would I put them in a box? They have handles anyway, so I figured just carry them out. So yeah, basically the shelves are completely done. All the tufting stuff has been packed up, obviously besides my framing. All right, so a few days later, and this is what we've done. And for the most part, it's basically done. So tables taken apart, everything on it was cleared off. All the boxes are stacked in the corner. All the shelves are cleared, even though they kind of don't look like it right now. This is basically the room now. I do wish that you guys knew what it looked like before, because it might, <laughs> it might honestly look pretty crazy still. This never got addressed and it will 
um, probably tomorrow, actually. But all the big stuff, like the shelves and like everything that's going on over here, like the table, everything looks really good. Obviously, we're going to clear stuff out and then I'm going to come back and like sweep and really, you know, do that last cleaning bit. But yeah, all of, uh, all of my craft stuff is stacked up in boxes. It's just kind of crazy that like, I mean, I know we weren't here for super long, but it is like echoey in here again. It's weird. Like, I don't know. I'm super excited to show you guys where we're going and I think it's going to be awesome. I forgot this was here actually. I'm so excited to bring this mirror to the new house. I'm so putting this in my bedroom. I'm so excited. We're basically done. So <laughs> the art studio, the art space is completely packed up. And the next thing that we're going to do is move it all to the new space. So obviously I'm going to show you guys that as well. Because I feel like that's going to be super, super exciting to be able to, I don't know, just like redo an entirely new space. And I'm just really excited about it. So the art space is packed up. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I really hope you enjoyed it. Make sure you give this video a like, subscribe to my channel and my art channel, and follow me on Instagram and TikTok. It is at artsymadwoman. I love you guys to absolute death, and I will see you in the next video. Bye! <laughs>